In 1906, an earthquake rippled through the streets of San Francisco. It took less than a minute to reduce a quarter of the city's buildings to rubble. In the ensuing fires, some 28,000 structures were destroyed. Over half of the city's 400,000 residents were left homeless. But for many years, the actual number of fatalities was unclear. In an effort to protect the commercial viability of their city, local leaders downplayed the amount of damage caused by the earthquake and fires, and rushed to declare a death toll that counted less than 500 fatalities in a natural disaster that was regarded as the worst in American history until Hurricane Katrina almost a century later. Those who suddenly stopped hearing from their loved ones were simply left wondering what had happened to them. It took a very special woman almost 50 years of exhaustive research to uncover the identities of more than 3,000 people who were never included in the initial death toll. Her name was Gladys Hansen. Appointed as the official archivist emeritus of San Francisco by Mayor Joseph Aliotto in 1972, Gladys Hansen worked tirelessly to rewrite the long accepted story of the 1906 earthquake until she retired from city service in 1990. Through her efforts, we have come to dramatically revise both the number of deceased and the political and economic history of the period. Surprisingly, there had never been a physical marker to remember the thousands of lives that were actually lost during the earthquake. But in 2006, Gladys Hansen and Cypress Lawn worked to correct this through the creation of the 1906 earthquake memorial, comprised of the actual stones from that time. Gladys Hansen passed on May 11, 2017. Thursday, October 18, 2018 at 11 a.m., the public is cordially invited to the dedication of the new Gladys Hansen Memorial, featuring an inscribed tribute to her remarkable life and work. This new stone memorial will be consecrated at Pioneer Mound on the west campus of Cypress Lawn. She spent decades helping others remember the lives of loved ones. Please join us in remembering and honoring the life of Gladys Hansen.